My name is Bobby McCutcheon and my history with wearable art, this will be my fourth year. I used to like going and then I just had this weird crazy idea to make a dress out of just beads, no fabric. I got inspiration from a necklace that I had made and I'm like, you know, I could probably make that into a skirt. I've always wanted to make stuff. I'd make my own paper dolls and dresses, I'd draw them all out, and I'd color them all, and I'd cut them all out, and she'd have like, um, you know, six or seven outfits, my little paper doll. <laughs> this year, I, I think I'm getting better at it, because this year I actually got done in late fall, instead of taking a full year, which is what it usually does. This is an example of the width I can get off of my loom. And then you can see where I sewed it together to this one. And then I make these all these pieces separately on the loom. And these are hard to make on a loom because they're an odd shape. This is the result of the Egyptian necklace done on a huge scale. I guess you could wear it as a cape if you put it around your neck. <laughs> Bustier frame. This is the first year I've actually used a frame. Um, everything else is just all beads, but I wanted a, a set design, and I had this in my closet. So, and this shows all the stitching. Um, this is the pattern I drew on the front of the piece, and so I just followed my magic marker pattern on the front. Um, you can't see the stitching in the bra cups because it's done like an invisible stitch all on the outside. These are bra cups too for the shoulder pads. And this is like a double. This is actually a stitch invention I made up for this um, so it would stand up. These are pins <laughs> dipped in glitter and glue. I stuck those in there. And it's supposed to be like kind of like the ancient Roman armor um, on the front like the ancient Roman armor. I made a helmet and shoes to go with it. 